Good morning and welcome to the Memorial Morning Show. Brought to you by the Memorial AV Club. Coming to you from our new TV studio, my name is Zoe. Here are some news and updates about school clubs. The Ski and Snowboarder Club has begun. For those of you who are participating, you will meet the following Mondays, February 13th, February 27th, March 13th, and the cost is 143 for six weeks. Equipment and rental costs are an additional cost. Be a radio streaming star. Do you want to play music or make music? Do you want to do you want it to air on the radio? Memorial's AV Club has a streaming radio station, and we want your music. Send your music files to Mr. Landry at LandryC at Bitchburg.k12.ma.us or stop by his room to airdrop them. The Family Winter Festival will be on Wednesday, February 15th from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m here at Memorial. There will be displays from clubs, sports, and STEM, as well as uh, crafts to make and a raffle. Some reminders from the office, slides or open-toed shoes are not allowed to be worn in school. Hoods are not allowed to be worn in school. Always have your agenda with you when you're walking in the halls. Remember to check your extra grade book often for updates on your grades and progress in your classes. Now we will go to Studio B where we have information on our national day. <laughs> Hello, I'm Mose. Today is National Day today is National Umbrella Day. The National Umbrella Day cast a little shade on February tenth. A day Honors one of the most youthful and vicious in the, the umbrella in the world, the umbrella. Not only does the umbrella help keep us dry from the rain, but also protect us from the heat of the sun. You can also use an umbrella as a fashion accessory. While the umbrella is primarily practical, these brightly colored papers, paper umbrellas make for make fun party favors, especially when visiting locate when visiting sunny locations. The word umbrella comes from the Latin word umbra, meaning shade or shadow. Probably is a slang word for for umbrella. Often used in Britain, New Zealand, Australia and South Africa. Bumper shot is a fanciful Americanism for an umbrella from the late nineteen hundreds. The basic umbrella has in, was invented over 4,000 years ago. There is evidence that umbrellas in the ancient art and artifacts of Egypt, Assyria, Greece, and China. We can credit the Chi we can credit the Chinese for being the first to protect us from the rain. The paper parasol received a layer of wax, a layer of wax or by lacquer that made the umbrella withstand the elements. One of the first umbrella shops opened in, in 1830 at 53 New Oxford Street, London, England. The shop operated by James Smith and Sons still operates regular hours at the same location today. In 1928, hands and soft pocket umbrellas appear. Then in 1969, Bradford E. Felix, owner of Toads Incorporated of Loveland, Ohio, obtained a patent for the first working folding umbrella. Now we'll go back to Studio A. New books are out now. Prices have risen to $30 each. If you would like to purchase one, please pick up and order from at the office or from Mr. Landry in room 243. Speaking of yearbooks, the yearbook committee will be walking around taking pictures for the yearbook. You can spot them as the students wearing the yearbook badges. Be ready to strike a pose or give your best smile. They will be around during <coughs> events, spirit weeks, and special occasions such as holidays. 
Speaking of school events, another spirit week is coming up. January 13th through the 17th, we will have our next spirit week. There, here are the themes you need to be aware of. Monday, February 13th, Jersey Day. Wear your favorite sports jersey. Tuesday, February 14th, Valentine's Day. Wear red, pink, or white. Wednesday, February 15th, Rhyme Day. Get a partner and be two things that rhyme. For example, slime and time, cook, or book. Tuesday, February 16th, Memorial Pride Day. Show your, the school some love. Friday, February 17th, Heritage Day. Show your heritage pride. Some important dates for you to remember. Winter break will be from February 20th through the 24th. Now we go back to Studio B for the weather, sports, and more. Today's forecast will be partly cloudy and windy with a high of 52 and a low of 30 degrees. This weekend will be partly sunny weather with highs in the 40s and lows in the 30s. Now for sports. There are currently no teams playing. Stay tuned for next team season. Today we will bring you Fun Fact Friday. This week we will bring you some fun facts about Fitchburg. Fitchburg was once part of Lüneburg, which was also part of Lancaster. In 1719, when Lüneburg was created, the courts called the area that is now Fitchburg, Turkey Hills. In 1764, Fitchburg was officially separated from Lüneburg. Fitchburg is noted for the Rollstone Boulder, a 11-ton specimen of granite, which is in a small triangular park adjacent to the city green. The boulder was a feature of the summit of Rollstone Hill. It was exploded and reassembled on the green in 1929 and 1930. A plaque attached to the boulder today reads in part, this boulder carried by the last glacier from Mount Mondanock, New Hampshire to the summit of the hill whose name com commemorates it was a centuries uh, landmark to Indian and settlers thrown with destruction by Korean operations. It was saved by popular subscription. Fitchburg was also is home to the Top Fun Avenue Museum. This is the first and only toy museum in the world that's completely devoted to aviation related toys. Including in the museum's collection of over 2,000 toys are tin toys from Japan, Hungary, and Germany, and the United States. Top Fun Aviation Museum. Our book fair is coming the week of February 13th through 16th. It is the week right before February break. Great time to look for some new books to read during your vacation. Also, Valentine's Day is Tuesday the 14th. If you want to treat your Valentine or yourself to a book, the fair is a perfect place to do so. If you come to the Winter Family Festival, then you can come to the book fair during that time as well. Look for the flyers being sent home for additional information. See you there. And now back to Studio A, where Jose has our school news in Spanish. Buenos días, me llamo José. Comienza a estar una silla de la radio. Tocas esa música. Quieres hacer eso en la radio. Memoria CB Club tiene una emisora de radio y streaming y queremos tu música. Envía tus archivos musicales al señor Landre. Al Landre y se arroba fichuarca 12ma. Pásate por la sala para darnos en el aire. Algunos decoratorios de la oficina no se permite el uso de zapatillas o zapatos abiertos en la escuela. Siempre tengan su agenda con ustedes cuando caminan por los pasillos. 
Recuerda revisar tu cuaderno de calificaciones X2 con frecuencia para estar al tanto de tus calificaciones y progreso en tus clases. Algunas fechas importantes para que ustedes recuerden. Miércoles 8 de febrero es un día pedido de maestro, así que es un día de semana temprana, también conocido como ayer. Invierno será el del 20 al 24 de febrero, las vacaciones de invierno. La feria de libre Scholastic será del 13 al 16 de febrero. Y la aplicación para la Academia de Honor de Fitchburg High School está abierta. That is all for today. Remember that you can watch the Memorial's Morning Show on our YouTube channel on FATV and listen to our streaming radio station at radio.cjlander.com every morning during school at 7.30 a.m. You can also watch old episodes on our YouTube channel. To find our YouTube channel, just do a Google search for Memorial Middle School Fitchburg or find the link on our school website. Thank you for watching and have a and remember to watch again for all our school news. We have have a great have a great Memorial Panther Day.